mind focus. Yeah. Oh, uh, we're going to Infinity War again tonight. Shoot. You know, I, I told you to tell me if you're going there again because I want to <laughs> see it a second time, but uh, my girlfriend saw it once now, and now I'm waiting to watch it a second time with her. Uh, so, yeah, sir, I'm totally ditching on you. No, it's no problem. I really want to watch it again. And I told her, I said, I can watch it, like, five times and still watch it with you. I'll still want to watch it. But she's like, no, I want to watch it with you. <laughs> so I'm waiting. I'm waiting. I'm saving that for her. So no, that's cool. Sorry, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hope you get a hot date instead of me. <laughs> I got a bunch of people going. I just thought I'd let you know. <laughs> I, got, I got so many people. I, I, don't, I don't need you. Just throw Walter on I, top of the pile. You were, you were like a fifth wheel anyway. <laughs> so a used one is 60 bucks for an accelerator pedal. So cut it. Yeah, we're going we're gonna to cut the pedals down there. <laughs> before, we, <laughs> before we get to that, um, I wanted to show you this camera really quick. Or try to. Here's a mirror. Um, it's a new camera. If you didn't see, a ghost knocked over my camera and broke it. So, uh, new lens, new camera. Uh, I love this motorcycle handle grip, essentially, is what that is. So, I, I might make a video about that later. But what we're doing today mainly is the dash. We're also going to do a couple other things. We're going to place a light bulb up there. And we're trying to do pedals, too. They don't really make Jeep-specific pedals. Because um, I have race seats, we're going to go with race pedals and that means um some i hesitate to use the word fabrication but we gotta do some metal work we have to drill into these and then we have to uh well probably cut this down so uh yeah more or less permanent stuff but then the main thing we're gonna do is try to uh customize this dash uh red like i painted the rest of my stuff we're also gonna try to change the led so i don't know if i can Turn this on so you can kind of see what I'm talking about. There we go. So all those lights, I want to change the color of a lot of them. One thing I really want to change is there's a seatbelt and airbag light that are on constantly because I replaced the seats so they're not plugged into the original seat warmers and so those lights are always on. I'm just going to remove those LEDs and for the most part all the lights are going to be red with the exception of some others like I'm going to change the turn signals from green to yellow. And I'm gonna change the high beam from green to white. All lights are gonna be white, and I have my own colors that I want. But anyway, so we're actually gonna have to take this out and then take it apart and do some like kind of detailed work just to kind of change, you know, what my uh, face looks like. But anyway, let's go to the whatever it is we're doing first. I'm not sure if it's the bulb or the or the pedals. So in order to get to this light, I gotta cut off my makeshift cage. Bam! Permanent paint damage. All right. This is like a, what, a $20 shelf piece. You can see it was white, spray painted black as a divider. I'm gonna put in a net or an actual cage there one day or something, but right now I just need to take this out. It's a really easy, cheap solution to keeping the dog from jumping up to the front. Um, I think I need a flat. I remember my brother really struggled with this. And then he was like, oh, this is what you're supposed to do. And, feel like you're supposed to push it in and pull at the same time, which is not working for me. I definitely want a flat screwdriver. Dose. Ooh, uh, this one. Thank you. Uh, this one might be a hair yeah. thinner. That was oh. really easy, but there yeah, there's go. a tab right here for the screwdriver. Nice. That's Perfect. a light bulb? Kind of. I wouldn't call it a bulb. It's, it's LEDs, you it's know? It's like a board of LEDs. Yeah. That's crazy. <laughs> Walter likes lights on his Jeep, and he found a way to add more lights. <laughs> surprise, <laughs> Three surprise. Three versus like 60. Hmm, I wonder which one he's gonna go for. So yeah, he's <laughs> looking at the connections on the back. Oh yeah, it's just like a regular festoon bulb. Yep. That's pretty tight. Okay. Cool, how do we test it? You need to turn the key, turn it forward just a little bit. That's an, there you go. Hey, it works. Yep. Now it looks just like the front one. Magical. Yeah, that was a really important, for five minutes. Yeah, that was the easy one. This is gonna be a spare now. Trying to do this through a camera lens is difficult. Very difficult. It's like watching your hand do things you don't want it to do. Anyway. I would require for this activity a seven millimeter wrench thingy. I made a video showing um, how to take the dash out and put in this C cane for some reason you wanna look at that, but in order to get to the dash here, it has to come out again. I've taken this off several times by now. I'm gonna try to do this in such a way where I don't have to take it all the way off, but you can see what we're trying to get is this whole bit right here. It's easier if I had my actual tools here. I saw an actual tool. 
Uh, it's like from a Fisher Price set. <laughs> <laughs> it might as well be. Boom. There we go. There you go. Cool. From this point on, it gets very more technical, like with parts and stuff. But let's head inside and uh, have some light and such. Yeah. Let's tear it apart. That's the fun part. So. Oh, well, that was. Do quick. the chromy chromes come out? Yeah, that's what I'm hoping for. I don't think they do, but. Could paint the whole thing red. That'd be obnoxious. <laughs> That'd be so gross. I bet they can pop out. Aha, uh -huh. they have tiny oh, little thingies. If you had a really thin plier, you could go push, 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 push. Well, that's probably just plastic, but pl plexiglass. Yeah, common, plexiglass common is the term, term for glass plastic. Well, why don't they call it glastic? <laughs> I wonder if glastic really is a thing. Anyway, so this face came off. This face came off. You're going to try to take those chrome rims out for me because I'm going to paint them red. And then we'll get to this, but I'll catch up in a, in a bit here. Oh, it went all the way back the wrong way. Are you positive? Because it go. was it was like just above empty, and now I don't know where it is. Gosh darn it. <laughs> Wait, yeah, I do have pictures of it right here. Ish. Ish. You can kind of see it's like in the red zone. Yeah, when it's off, it goes down to nothing. Yeah, but it, it was low on gas. Oh. Well, perfect. We'll it is close. Now Now the fuel is probably going to be <laughs> probably going to be wrong. Dang it. Wow, I messed that, that up. Even without the uh, trim on here, they, this looks good. <laughs> it's just matte black, but... Uh, we sanded these down, you can kind of see they're, most of that chrome is chipped away. We're going to paint those red. Yep. Just coming straight out. Cool. Whoa. Wow, that's a... Uh, oh, it took the whole shaft out. Well, dang. All right. I mean, I think that's okay. I mean, that plate will come out with a knife. Oof. Oof. <laughs> the same oh. thing. <laughs> no, worse this time. See that uh, metal? Yeah. Don't like a little weight. I hope it's just a weight. I think it's, um... I think it's just a weight. There's no contacts in here. Okay. Yeah, I think you're right. But that'll have to be put back together. Mm -hmm. <laughs> It'll work. Just give it a minute. It's going very slowly. That's kind of nerve-wracking. That's just very slow. In the words of Obi-Wan Kenobi, Oh, this is going to be easy. Oof. Oh, I did not like that sound. So the same thing. <laughs> the cover pops but off. I don't see a weight. Let's make mental notes. Yeah, we're making mental notes. Yeah. I feel it just like the last one. Yeah. Cool. I'm just going to attach this back together over here. Boom. All right. The needles are out. That's probably the hardest part. I don't know. Hopefully, actually, we'll see. We'll see about the, the diodes, but that was a little, a little scary. Are you serious? Doink. Look at that knife. That was necessary. Me. I said, are you serious? <laughs> and my phone heard, hey Siri. Don't you just love technology <laughs> and the advancements? Can you believe we were in space like 50 years ago on the moon? And this is what we this have. This is where we are. <laughs> this is where we are. <laughs> Forgot to mention or record the little black tabs. They're very flat and very small. And he's using a very small knife. <laughs> it's just very flat and long. He has the right amount of leverage, as oh. Sparrow would say. And then it's destroyed. Anyway. Oh, you can see. actually see the holes. The break and stuff. Oh, yeah. Hold it up to that light a little bit so the camera can see. Well, that'll help me out. The only issue is you can't tell for sure what color luminance is. I've never seen that one before. Go back. It's a gas light with, with raindrops by it. Like, what, yeah, is, what the hell is what that? What is that? Gas leak? <laughs> Hmm. I, I, maybe maybe it's uh, you have water in your gas or you, yeah. your cheapo light. I don't. I don't think That's it's funny. This is not easy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> These are awkward little objects to wipe. It's gonna get worse because you put a piece of cardboard over there on the floor to paint these with. I'm thinking, you're gonna trust me to spray paint at your floor? <laughs> Are you sure? I can put more cardboard down. <laughs> it's up to you, more I cardboard. A of, I, a lot, I got a lot of cardboard. Do a light coat on the first pass. Let's see? Good. So it's going to be some of these guys and some of these guys. Yeah. Neat. One reason you haven't seen that uh, 
crying fuel light is because there's no diode there. Oh. Isn't that weird? What the hell is that? <laughs> it's like, the, let's turn it off. Let's put a diode in there and see what it is. <laughs> I really don't want to. because you what, seen that before? Let me see. You it's, come. it's a fuel pump with droplets next to it. What would that mean? Moisture in your water? Or I, that was my guess. Maybe in other countries there's they no, have that? There's no diode there, so it never illuminates. It's like they designed it with. That's stupid. Let's not put it in. Maybe, it's, too maybe late. it's four other countries where they have like bad gas problems <laughs> to warn you that you got bad gas. What is that? That uh, top metal you one. Know what? That those? is an inductor. I've never seen that light up either. You don't have a light there. Mystery solved. <laughs> there are arrows that indicate what direction the diode has to yes, face. Yes, because they are directional. Because they and are diodes. I'm not sure where the arrow is. Actually, I don't see arrows on this board. It's hard to zoom into this board all the way. I'm really sorry. I'm, I'm trying these, to get as close uh, as I can. These little gold arrows. Which is K. Yep. <laughs> Duh. Those are them. And uh, the LEDs that we have should have some kind of indication. Okay. I just unpackaged one of the new diodes. It is so tiny. I can't even. I can't even focus on it. You can see it in that spoon. Eat it. <laughs> Yum, crunchy. But it's gotta go in here and yeah. Does that, does that look scary to you? Here. <laughs> you can see the contacts on yeah. there. It's super tiny. It's not something I've done before, but Oh uh, you can you can do it. I don't see a... oh I guess that's the arrow. See how one corner is cut off? Yep. <laughs> that must be it. It's so tiny. <laughs> Are these? Oh yeah, these all have one corner cut off. Okay. Yep. We got something to go off of then. Would it help if I put the camera closer to your face? Yes. <laughs> Rest it on my cheek. Hey, look at that. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't think I was gonna do it, did you? Did it so come off one? That's end one or? side off. Can you tell? Yeah, I can, but I don't think the camera can see it. Let's try to get it in there. Wow. Yeah, you can see it. I'm not holding it very still. Yep. Yep. You can see it. Caffeine makes me shaky. Good. <laughs> Look at that. One, one tooth removed. Good job. So I'll put a little solder on there first like that, and then and I'll kind of... Sorry if I'm getting in your way, let me know. You're I'm not. Just, I'm trying to record this. Oh, no. It's really tough. All right. You suggest one side first and then the other, but you know what? I trust you to do it your way, so. There we go. That's one. This isn't so bad. Do you yeah, think it's just... worth taking upstairs and plugging the Jeep just, just to see that one diode? I don't think it would hurt anything. Bing. Bing. All right. Bing -ish. Why don't you just leave the face off and ride around like this? <laughs> just with the needle, put the needles back in. Looks and... awesome. We got an 80s gauge. <laughs> All right. Whoopsie. That's it. That's oh, the... yeah, the blinker's on. Okay, we turn this. Hopefully, it's white. I don't see it. Are your fog lights on? Yeah. No. Oh, there it is. Woo! Yeah, cool. It's really bright. Yep. Nice. So those red are for the red needles, and the white is to light up the numbers behind mm. it, which I'm totally fine with those colors, so. All right, cool. Let's go down and do the rest then, I guess. Neat. Make sure you get a shot of how jittery I am. <laughs> you just had caffeine, and, and then you like, look really get a, close. Get a shot of the monster. <laughs> <laughs> See? <laughs> <laughs> we have a system going on where I give him the bulb, and I identify where it goes, and he does it. And so um, we're going to keep this up until we get done, and I'll come back after we have the bulbs replaced. Poor Reed, so shaky. Stupid yeah. monster energy. All right. That's the last one though, so. Well, hopefully those are all correct. So we're gonna plug it in without putting it together and see if, for the most part, the lights look correct. So, I'm excited. I see red lights. A lot of red lights. Let's try a couple main ones. So here's our whites. High beam up there. That's the white one. Turn signal's the one I'm really curious about. So let's hit this, see if it's yellow. Oop, nope. Huh. Can't think Try of the actual turn signal. No. Oh, they're not coming on. Hmm. Interesting. They're not backwards. We'll just have to check the solder joints. But it's very particular. That's those two. Yeah. Um, what about all the others? Yeah, stuff? I'm worried about the other yellow ones. No yellows. Hmm. Maybe the yellow ones are defective. Oh, wait, I never changed them to yellow. I'm, I'm doing the sway bars. Um, which are here and they're not lighting up either. Maybe the Jeep has to be on, but I'm trying tracks control and oh, I doubt it. But yeah, let's hope for the best here. I'm afraid about what could go wrong. Could go wrong. Some more red ones. The yellow ones aren't working. Hmm. And also. The 
brake light. Interesting. None of those are working either. Did you plug in all three or just two? Say what? Oh, I plugged them all in. We could recheck and make sure they're tight. You know what I'm thinking? What do you think? Maybe these lights complete a circuit. So maybe we should try putting those back in. That's a good idea. Let's put a... Let's put them back in, I guess. Good thing we tested it. Let's go see if we can fix that. Cool. Oh, all right, ready? Yeah. And the moral so, truth, push the hazard button down there. Which is this one. Damn it. That's weird. Only the white ones we put in work. That's a regular bulb. The white ones we put in work, the red ones and none the yellow the ones. ones are working? Yeah, or the none of them work. Maybe they're a different voltage. It looks like we have no choice but to just leave them there for now and then see about getting them replaced, but. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go test one downstairs. Sure. One, one of the ones we haven't put in yet. Just tucking your butt in that fender well. Are you perfect fit? Yeah. Just, just a little butt armor right there. Yeah. <laughs> he just chooses to back into a corner and chooses this little butt plate. All we know is two white ones worked, but none of the amber or the red ones worked. Right. They look, I mean. Should we try the, a white one on the battery? Well, I think it'll explode, but I mean, I, I guess there's no reason not to. All right. Died. Did it flash? Yep. I thought it did. I didn't see it on camera, but I saw so it. So they don't like 12 light. volts, that's for damn sure. What I'm thinking is the white ones are probably a different voltage rating than the amber and red ones. Mm -hmm. So you need to get amber and red ones that are the same as the white one. That'd be my guess. That's the only guess I have. Because the white ones went in the same as everything else. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I guess we just gotta put it back together and have it that way until or if I can find threat replacements. Otherwise I won't have lights for a while. Yeah. Alright. Alright, now we're gonna try the pedals, which I mean, failure could keep following us, but um, we're gonna cut the original gas pedal to make the new pedal fit on there. Because it's a universal pedal. If you look, if you line it up, you can see it's not the same size. So we're probably gonna cut the original pedal to get this one to fit. Because worst case scenario, buying a replacement pedal, like an OEM one's like $60, this one's $20 or, you know, the set for three is $60. So cutting to put this one on and drilling to screw it in. And these have to be drilled. These are the rubber pads that came on there. So yeah, that's the third and final bit that we're gonna try on the Jeep today. Let's get a general idea of what I wanna do. How high do you want this thing? Do you want it? I think all the way up. All the way up, so. Because you use uh, your toes to, to use the pedal, you know, so that makes sense. So probably about like that. Yeah, but as far as how much to cut off, um, I would say below, this bottom screw pl plate, but above the bottom. So not flush, but like in between. So above these holes. Oh yeah. Okay. Yeah, for sure. That'll be easy. I'll cut this side off here and then this side off here. Seems like a lot of extra cutting. Are you okay with doing that? Yeah. Okay. Because the support goes all oh, the way. Oh, I know it'll, I know it'll work. It's just a lot here. of extra cutting to make it look better essentially. It'll be fine. So I'll kind of offset it over a little bit like that. Okay. So that you don't see the support underneath. Yeah, that'll, that'll yeah, be cool. All right. Man. Check out that weight reduction, bro. Oh yeah, dude. Let's add some metal back on. <laughs> cool. Yeah, it looks good, man. It'll look legit. Since that's plastic, we'll just drill an undersized hole and then ram this in there. Yeah. And it'll stay in, because they're not long enough to put the nut on the back. But that'll hold. Okay. That'll hold great. I'm thinking on these, we won't use the nuts either. We'll drill a hole and then tap it for the threads. And then put Loctite on it and then you won't need the nuts. As long as the pedals stay, then I don't care. Yep. Okay. You said sparkle pedals. I was like, I didn't know they were called sparkle. If I hadn't they were called sparkle, I wouldn't have gotten them. <laughs> Sparko. Sparko. All done? All done. Cool, man. Maybe we should just kind of check all the solder joints. I mean, it's, it's extremely unlikely. Yeah, I was gonna say, why would every single one of these be undone? Maybe they're all backwards. Because remember you were trying to test them and... And one of them was backwards. Well, when you were testing one here, you said they're backwards. So maybe the yellow one. ones are correct and everything else is wrong. Only, the way to test that would be to flip one of them backwards, plug in if that lights up, there's a good chance the reds and the yellows are backwards. Let me try. Just turn it like, till I get a click. 
and then hit the hazard button. Oh, hey. look at that. So they're backwards, maybe. It looks like it, dude. Mm. Look at that. That's stupid. Something stupid that I just took a guess on. It looks like it's going to work. Okay. I'm, hey, we both guessed, like, I doubt this is going to fix it. We both guessed, we doubt, but we're like, we hope we're wrong. Looks like we were wrong. Let's hey, go. gas comes on, too. <laughs> That's what it is. That's hey, yeah. really dumb, but okay. Hey man, I'll, I'll take a solution. As long, yeah. <laughs> a dumb solution is still a solution. Yeah. All right, cool. Let's go down and just redo all the work, I guess. Neat. All right. There's a bunch of reds. Hey, lots of red lights. There's a red one that down there. I didn't illuminate. I don't know, but uh, hit the hazards. That's hot. Those both work. Bro, how cool is that? I'm gonna hit the locker here. It's, just, it's one of those bottom two ones, so tap Should it. Should I start it first? Nope, that's working. Oh, good. So turn it off, let's put this mamma jamma together downstairs. I'm excited. Ooh. Ooh. Uh, I'm gonna grab a small one and just start with that. Nice, bro. So, should we use something else besides my fingers to push it in? Mm, you could use the towel. Let's use the towel. This goes in the bottom here. Oh, okay. Yep, and now I'll this towel. Six is the appropriate word to use. That's, that's about it. Hmm? That looks good. Looks good. Dude, I'm so happy about that. That is sharp. And we got the lights to work today, too. Somehow. <laughs> Success story. Right, let's put it back together. Oh, so pretty. Yeah. And nice and pretty and nice. And pretty. <laughs> Forget that. Now, if only I could figure out how to get these little tiny little chrome rims off. <laughs> I, maybe Just one day. Destroy all chrome. <laughs> oh, I forgot the pedals were down there. Those look good. Yeah. Boom. Okay. And now, this is the easy part. I mean, that was a most of it, so now this is gonna get plugged back in. Click, and then lock, and then click again, like this. And then this one, no tools needed. I'm done. Look at that. This one also should be tightened, technically, so. Yeah, look at that dash, dude. Ooh, 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 it's all red. Look at that. Oh, that's sharp, dude. Yellow turn signals. And then high beams here. White. Fog lights, white. Oh, that's sharp. Do you like it? You just like, I like it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Little giggles. Looks good. That looks good, dude. I'm really happy you got that done. Thanks a lot for the help. I'm just glad it worked. <laughs> but I forgot I was on these pedals. We might stick a third nut in there just to make it look pretty but i guess it feels a little different i don't know i'm gonna have to let you drive this yeah i mean it won't feel different to me <laughs> yeah but still your handiwork so that's good well i'm glad that worked out i thought we were gonna end this video saying oh yeah well the dash didn't work out no it worked out uh, it looks awesome so uh hope you guys enjoyed this little random ruby tuesday uh we're gonna go eat food because it's been a while it took us a while to do all this we were here for Six hours? Dude, no, it it's like, it's six like five. It's like five. Anything. Five hours. So that was a while, but we're done. We're gonna go. Hope you guys enjoyed it. See you later. Bye.